Hey guys, so I would like to tell you about my Costco trip yesterday that I did really early in the morning. I got there, I was hoping before the store opens. Well, I heard about the senior hours, uh, but uh, I didn't fi figure out that they open the store now like two hours earlier, like eight senior people go there and at nine everyone else starts to go instead of the usual 10 a.m. So I had to wait in line for quite a bit, even though I got there at 9 a.m. Um, I think I waited like around 40 minutes to get in. No, maybe like an hour, at least an hour, yes. But I did end up going in and, um, well, <laughs> come see what I'm, I've been doing and what I've been getting. So they had the wipes, which is a, which is a usual thing now. and. Um, yeah, so I kept on going after the wipes and I started looking at the things they have next to the door and it's usually like some seasonal stuff and this time they have a little bit of Easter stuff but I honestly was disappointed by the selection of stuff that Costco had for Easter. So I first went to check out the um, water aisle because I needed to pick up some water and I wanted to see if the toilet paper was in stock. and. Since I had my cards, I needed to start with putting the water in it because I didn't have the usual shopping card. I used my own. I brought my own card because I don't want to touch anything or anyone in the store. So as you can see on the right, all the way up at the top of the water, they have toilet paper stocked up, even though it's not the toilet section, the toilet paper section. And then at the end of the uh, this aisle, they have a ton of uh, Charmin toilet paper out, so at least they started producing toilet paper and have it in stores now. But I didn't need any, so um, I just kept on walking. Uh, I went to the pharmacy section because I wanted to see if they had food to because I'm pretty much out of them, but they didn't have any, so I just picked up some more for them instead. And then I picked them up. Um, I wanted to pick out like something nice and close for my little one, so I found this like little cute robe from um, the stuffy food, and I got it for her, and then it's looking good. Um, and then uh, I just wanted to see what kind of candy they have, because it's a little candy, they have some good stuff, and I was not disappointed chocolate items they had there, they were amazing. You can see me putting a Costco bag inside my cart because I started filling it up with like little small things and I didn't want to get out of the cart so I just kept putting everything inside my shopping bag. By the way, if you guys are interested in seeing how I shop with a shopping cart instead of like the store cart, let me know because it's an interesting experience to share. Um, not everyone definitely goes to the same Costco, such as the store, with a cart. Um, but I needed to do it because um, uh, the line for the cars is kind of crazy. And uh, also, I didn't want to take a cab back because the cars... Well, I don't trust the cabs at this point. You can see most of the people, like, yes, people pass by each other, but everyone is keeping their distance, six feet or more, and most of the people are wearing masks. Um, I did wear a mask, but honestly, I could have done without it because I just got a headache from it instead of like it actually helping me, I think. But hopefully it did help. <laughs> Who knows? So yeah, I kept on getting like, a little bit of snacks and stuff like that. Probably some of the food doesn't approve of snacks, but I still went and got them. Um, oh, I was looking here, I was looking for mushrooms, but I found them at the end of the aisle. If you guys haven't tried these mushrooms, these chupati mushrooms, you definitely should try. They're my daughter's favorite. And they're like these salty cherry sweets. Honestly, they do not taste like mushrooms, but. I really like them 
and it's only one ingredient. It's, I think it's freeze dried like just shiitake mushrooms with some salt. That's it. I got some avocado oil. Um, I only used it a couple of times before, but the cost per price, you can't keep that. So I went and got a large bottle of it. And then I was just picking up, oh, I wanted to get peanut butter, but then the jars were so huge that I realized it would never go through it. So I just went and like, I left them because we still had some peanut butter and like, I'll just get something from um, Trader Joe's or from Coles later. I was like trying to find a spot to get the fish. I didn't want to be too close to people, but I still love my fish, so I waited for people to move to uh, go and get my fish. Yep. And then chicken, you could get only one per person, so I went and got some chicken breasts because I mean they're versatile and maybe they could eat them, so no. Um, yeah, that was me taking my time packing it all up because card going with the card is tricky. <laughs> mm. Mm, some snacks. Oh, I needed some uh, sliced cheese and then I got some Parmesan cheese because I have no idea when they will run out of it and we can stop uh, producing it. Uh, well, since it always closed, well, who knows if they will, like, they still producing it and then it will probably be shorter from a little bit. Oh, I got some turkey breast, uh, like turkey, smoked turkey or something like that, some lunch milk meat because I want to see if the little one makes it, you know, organic, so maybe she will because we have like, a lot of problems with, with eating food. In general, because well, me and I, uh, I really want her to start eating some kind of protein more often. I got some yogurt for her, and then I made my way to get some lemons. And after, oh, I got some chocolate lava cakes, which my husband loves and asked me to buy for him, so I got that for him. And then uh, I went to get some lemons, and then I went to get the greens because. That's a cold room. Oh, I got two bags of uh, grapefruits as well because we eat them like crazy. So yeah, um, yeah. In the cold room, I got some butter lettuces. It took me a while to find one that was um, good enough because all of them were like kind of brown. So I'm sorry, guys. I detached a lot of the stuff, but. I was wearing gloves and I was disinfecting my hands all the time anyway with gloves on, so yeah. Um, I got some asparagus, I got some green beans, I got some celery because that's the stuff we eat a lot of. Um, and then I got some grapes for the little one and some tomatoes, like the Campari ones and the Sweet Angel ones because we do like tomatoes and I add them to a lot of recipes. And I think at this point the cart was so full that I couldn't like um, keep putting, piling it up because it started closing the camera. So at this point I stopped filming. But here is what my cart ended up looking like because I also went to Target to pick up the Easter basket and some Easter treats for the little one for the Easter egg hunt. And let me know if you guys want to see the video of how we are celebrating Easter this year. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe!